what's up guys and welcome back to another video so guys i'm back with another video and today i'm going to teach you the topic sets sets is a very interesting topic okay so let's start our video before starting my video i want to tell you that if you are new on my channel please subscribe my channel and like my video so let's get started with the topic which is sets okay so now what is a set okay so what is a set set a set is a well defined collection of objects okay it is a well defined collection of objects a well defined collection collection of object okay so a set is a well defined collection of objects now what do you understand by the word well defined now what do you understand by the word well defined so the word well defined means that anything which can be counted by us easily and anything which is limited to an extent okay so what the word well defined means that anything which can be counted by us like the first five prime numbers they are can be counted by us easily so they are the it means that well defined okay so now we understood what is a set and what is the meaning of well defined now 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 we will now we will take some examples okay to know about set to know more about set okay so we will write um, the first five odd numbers okay and so we will have we will write the question which is the first five odd numbers numbers okay so the first five odd numbers are 1 3 5 7 and 9 now now i wanted to tell you that all the sets are written in brackets and are separated by commas so these are called braces and the each number is separated by commas okay so they are separated by commas okay now we have taken example also to more, learn more about sets now we will study about elements okay so i will erase this first and then i will tell you about elements elements are any objects that make up a set are called elements okay so they are objects which make up a set okay so elements are elements they are the objects they are the object which which make up a set okay so they are the object which make up a set like we have taken the example earlier the first five odd numbers so we have written like this 1 3 5 7 8 9 okay no now these numbers are called elements because they are making up a set a okay so these numbers are making up a set a so this this is called this is called set and these numbers which are making up a set are called elements okay so, okay now you are clear to you this about elements also now an object that belongs to a set is denoted by a symbol called epsilon symbol or we can also call it the belongs to symbol and the opposite of belongs to symbol is not belongs to symbol okay so an object we will write the definition of epsilon symbol okay so an object 
that belongs to to a set is denoted by a symbol called epsilon symbol epsilon or belongs to symbol object that belongs to a set is denoted by a symbol called epsilon or belongs to symbol and and the opposite of it is not belongs to symbol now i will tell you how uh, belongs to and not belongs to symbol are made and where are they used okay no no belongs to symbol is made like this okay belongs to symbol is made like this so we will name this belongs to belongs to now now the opposite of it means belong not belongs to symbol is made like this it is made first like this only and then we put a cut here it is not belongs to Okay, so it is a belongs to symbol and it is a non belongs to. Now we will take an example to see that where belongs to and not belongs to symbol are used. Now, now we will take seven. The set of odd number. Okay, so seven the set of odd number is seven in the set of odd numbers. So it is a odd number or not? Seven is odd number. So what we will write? We will write. We will use belongs to symbol because it belongs to the set of odd number. Okay. So we will use. We will use belongs to symbol here. We will use belongs to symbol here. Okay. Now, now we will take take an example for not belongs to symbol. So now we will take on that. Huh. Nine. The set. set of alphabet is nine of alphabet nine is not alphabet so what we will write it does not belongs to the set of alphabet so we will use the not belongs to symbol okay so now we have used because nine does not belongs to the set of alphabet because alphabet are a b c d e and nine is a set of numbers okay so we have used belongs to and non belongs to symbol in the example so bye guys in this video this much only we will meet in next video so if you have any doubt related to my video then you can comment me here on youtube or you can join my discord server and message me there so goodbye